Wow, Stuart really nailed the face drawing portion. He included eyelashes and expressive eyebrows. Must you narrate? The whole point of the audio enhanced plexiglass is that I can hear on my own. Oh boy, it's circle cutting time. Miss Carly's handing the scissors to Ruth. Ruth is taking the scissors. Ruth is starting to use the scissors. Don't tell me what she's doing. Actually, you know what? Tell me. Never tell me. Forget it. This is a disaster. We should Ruth go. Ruth S. Your circle is perfect. I knew it. I want to buy her yeah. things. I want to buy her lots and lots of things. Suck it, Benjamin. Your boosh just got amused. But what if it's not a circle, Miss Curly? No! What if it's a moon and it's sad because it's daytime? What a colossal crap of the bed. Ruth S. Wonderful imagination. You just earned three tadpoles. Three tadpoles! Three frickin' tadpoles! Everyone, right here. You know what got her those three tadpoles? Hippy dippy Michigas. Well, she couldn't cut a perfect circle without your cold blooded demand for excellence. Is it possible that after all of this time fighting, that together we're the perfect parent? I mean, look, you're sweet. You're salty. Excuse me, she lived inside of me, you jerks. No. No, Stuart! Uh, that's an oval! Oh, well, looky over there. What is this? Huh? I don't love you anymore. Ovals for losers. Hey, your name is Denise now. What? No, it's not, Schmidt's kid. Piccolo, 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 Piccolo! All right, I heard you. Too much pressure. He's a kid, Denise. Oh, boy. Why is she calling everybody Denise? The whole system is corrupt. Meow! <laughs> Jam the damn door shut with the piccolo.